up my beautiful dreams and welcome back for another video with your girl Shalanda One. Shalanda. Welcome back for another video with your girl Shalanda One. Okay guys, in this video we will be talking about Sedona Lace. Now, when I think back to my earlier days on YouTube, Sedona Lace was like it. You know what I'm saying? And it's so good to see their evolution and they're still around and they're still producing fantastic products. The bulk of my makeup collection, I have a lot of Sedona Lace brushes. Let's just say that. Like, I get down with their brushes. And in this video, I will be showing you one of their uh, brush sets as well as two palettes. Let's jump right in. So the first palette that I have, and this is the first palette right here. This is the case of it. And this is the palette. Palette is beautiful. Just look at how gorgeous. That palette is really, really pretty. So this has 10 shimmers as well as 10 um, mattes and five glitters. I'm just saying, love. I did use this palette and only this palette for this makeup look right here that I have on my eyes. And what I would say about the quality of the, um, the shadows, I'm not gonna lie, there's definitely some hits and misses in this palette. Um, for, the bulk, for the most part, Everything I used in my transition was amazing. But for the bulk, this is a phenomenal palette for the price. When I think about this palette, and I had to, after I was using it, I kept looking at it and looking at it, I was like, I've seen these colors before. If you are a person that could not get your hand on the Jaclyn Hill palette from Morphe, you will really like the, color, the uh, palette from Sedona Lace. If you look, those colors you're gonna see some dupes in here very much so the only thing that I think that I really like about this palette is that you have your glitters down there but I like me some glitter so I love that these glitters already have staying power can you just imagine what you use a uh, actual glitter adhesive and I'm just swatching the ones right here from said palette they actually have a black glitter. Can you believe it? They actually have a black glitter. And I know those are not the probably best swatches. But just to let you know, like if you use your glitter adhesive, that really is going to pop. Really pretty palette. I have to say, I don't have any problems with the um, pigmentation of them. Like I said, there's hits and misses. And it's you won't know until you actually get the palette. But some of these colors go on so beautifully. And other ones you might have to layer once or twice so I have to say for the price the fact that you can use this year round this is a year round product um palette you can have your everyday looks you can go to from day to night you have your colors you can have your smokiness if you want it and then on top of that is you have your glitters and that's glitter that's glitter that's gorgeous so you can use this palette can travel with it because it does come in a cardboard box. I mean, I'm here for it. I have to say this was a pleasant surprise. Now the next palette is the palette that just makes me happy. As I look at it, it simply makes me happy. It's a palette that I can sit and just look at. I'm in love with it. I'm in love with this palette. This is a palette that I wanted to just sit on top of my vanity and I might just put it in the back just so it can just go along with my decor because it's gorgeous. The best part is the inside. Oh! Oh! <laughs> it's just so freaking beautiful. If you are a person that's into glitter, and remember, certain times of the year, it's all about that glitter thing, not just New Year's. I mean, glitter can be worn anytime when you're really celebrating a look. Or if it's just Tuesday, if you want, it could be whatever you want. But I love, I wish this had a mirror and I also wish this one had a mirror. That's the only thing I don't like. They don't have mirrors. I wish it had, and it's not that it has to be, I would love the greatest quality mirror, but give me something. Beautiful. I love the array of colors in here. You have, it's so hard to swatch glitter, but 
uh, glitter is meant to be packed on, not swiped like I'm doing. But I really wanted you guys just to see how beautiful. Oh, I'm telling you, I am here for it. I love it. The last thing I want to share with you guys is their Vortex Professional Makeup Brush Set. And this is the little uh, card that comes in with it. And it comes in this bag here. And inside, you're going to see all the different brushes. I have them here in this. I did use them today, as you're going to see in some of the demos. So this is the foundation brush that I use. And this is just a flat top buffer brush. Real, this, this made my, make my foundation today go on beautifully. This works beautifully. If you are a person that's still into brushes, you're gonna find that this has a little bit of a bend. It's not super stiff, which is why I like it because it still allowed the brushes to help really buff the product in versus just sit on top of the skin. It really allows you some flexibility to move the product. Really, really enjoy her. Um, this is another brush. This is what you call the Tulip Contour Brush. So this brush, they were saying that you can use it in the hollows of your cheek, which you probably can. I personally really enjoyed fitting that tulip right in the hollow of that eye and setting my under eye makeup. Really, really, really enjoyed it for that. But that just goes to show that you can use the brushes how you see fit. What makes really, really great brushes great when you can use them a variety of ways. They also have this huge fan brush, which was a little overwhelming because I usually don't use fan brushes at all and then to use something this big. However, it did a great job on my highlighter today. I have to say, I, I'm not mad at it at all. It did a really good job. So the next brush and the reason why I was really excited for this brush is because if you guys watch my makeup, uh, I tried to follow the makeup Shayla's makeup tutorial video that I did. She used a brush very similar to this. I don't have that brush, but I really like that brush. I want the brush. I said I wanted that, I wanted a brush like that and I actually got my hands on it and really fell in love. Like this brush is described as a dome contour brush. So this dense dome shaped brush is perfectly it's perfect for buffing out a heavy contour. It definitely helps blend out that contour quite nicely. What I like about it is that it's dense, but again, has some flexibility to it. So I, it didn't just blend it out, but I was able to still move the product around my face and put it where I wanted it. Huge fan of that one. It's definitely one I will be using a lot. The rest of these brushes are for eyes and very detailed work. It also comes with a lip brush, but these brushes are all you need to achieve an eye look like I have on today. This is their yeah, this is their synthetic blending brush, which is really, really nice. Really liked it a lot. It was not the biggest blending brush that I would use for my usually transition, but that next brush that you would use to help really fill in that, um, crease is what I thought this was fantastic for but I used it for all of it today like this one a lot the next one is this one which I'm a huge fan of and this brush is so I'm guessing this is good their universal brush and what I like about it is that it almost looks like a um it's it's kind of tapered to the side I don't know if you can see that and I just found this fantastic for blending out that outer crease color and blending it in and doing like really in the crease um, blending work. Really like this brush. So right now these three brushes are my favorite eye brushes. These brushes will definitely be added to my everyday. These were great, really like these. So when you can get your hands on a collection, especially if you are a brand new person, makeup enthusiast, makeup artist, and you need a collection that you can get your hands on to do a full look, you can accomplish that with this. Remember, you can also use this to apply your overall face powder. There's so much you can do with these brushes. Do not limit your thoughts to you have to use it as described from their pamphlet. You can use these brushes as you see fit. Now on to the good stuff, guys. Sedona Lace and I will be doing a giveaway. You guys can get your hands on 
one of these lucky beautiful palettes yes god i love that you guys have an opportunity to get your hands on one of these palettes and these are the details Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much to Donna Lace for working with me on this video. I love you guys so much. If you haven't done so already, please rate, comment, and subscribe. You definitely want to subscribe so you never miss another video with your girl, Shalanda One. And be sure to click the bell. The bell helps you be notified when I upload my next video. I love you guys so much. Be sure to go absolutely everywhere and follow me at Shalanda One. Definitely enter the giveaway. All the important details will be below in the description box. So be sure to follow all the instructions. Follow the rules and all that good stuff so you can enter into this giveaway and i will see you guys in the very next video i love you guys Mwah.